My name is Kate A. Borman and I will be reading from my new horror thriller, Into the Sublime. Wednesday, July 26th, 1.02 p.m. The girl was a blood-spattered wood nymph, a tiny figure dwarfed by tall pine trees, a splash of sunlight filtering through the boughs above, dappling her slight shoulders and dark cap of hair with white gold. Blood had dried on her pale arms in a lattice pattern, dark crimson, elbow-length lace gloves. Gore and particulate speckled her face and neck. Her t-shirt, a six-inch long rip near the hem, jeans, and tennis shoes were coated with a chalky substance like ghastly fairy dust. She was perched on one of the three giant rocks placed in a line across the trailhead, feet on the boulder, wrists resting on her bent knees, gaze fixed on the ambulance. Behind her, a weathered wooden sign sported a sun-faded lacquered map, an uninspiring masthead detailing the hiking paths in the dense forest beyond. Next to the trail sign sat a steel box, holding an emergency phone she'd called from an hour ago. Her voice was hoarse and halting, giving only the most pertinent information. My name is Amelie Demeray. We're at the White River National Forest, staging area number 14. Come quickly.